This is the ultimate outdoor experience in Antalya, Turkey. Get ready as we tackle whitewater rafting, go off-roading, and soar through the sky on a zip line. We are in Antalya about to go whitewater rafting. Hello, my name is Alfredo and this is Soft Strip. I introduce you to a place to just make soft, the last strip, or take you on one of my adventures. If this is your first time to my channel, please hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. More information is listed below. We found an epic 3-in-1 adventure with tornado rafting in Antalya, Turkey. They provided everything we needed, from transportation to all the gear we needed, and even an orientation on what to expect. They even provided lunch, making it a hassle-free adventure. We are at the start of our rafting. Check out this bridge over the river. It's kind of cool. So right now we're walking to the starting point of this rafting trip. It's been a lot of work walking so far. The Kapurlu Canyon River is an awesome place for rafting. It's known for its crystal clear waters and exciting rapids that will keep you on the edge of your seat with its class 3 and 4 rapids. The water stays a refreshing 54 to 59 degrees Fahrenheit year round, which feels fantastic against the Turkish heat. Throughout the rafting tour, you'll often find yourself in water fights against other rafters. It's a lot of fun. This day was definitely our favorite day in Turkey and one of the most memorable days during this entire trip. Halfway down the river, we took a fun break for a quick snack then hopped on quads and buggies for some off-roading fun. <laughs> so we just put sunscreen on and then they sprayed us with water and they washed off. <laughs> We spent about an hour tearing through the desert and splashing through muddy trails. We were definitely covered in mud and dirt after this adventure, making it a thrilling contrast to our rafting adventure. Drop dead. So Ashley's our driver here. And we're just kind of doing figure eights and get hit. Whoa. A lot of fun. Get down, get down, Because there wasn't a shortage on mud and desert, we were able to rotate and take turns driving the buggy. After our off-road adventure, we jumped back into the river for a refreshing swim and to wash off all that mud. It felt amazing to cool down and clean up after our thrilling quad and buggy ride. The next day, we were still covered in mud, places where we never thought mud could reach. Proof that just how epic and messy that off-roading was, but it was a lot of fun. Get down, get down, get down. 
After we docked, we took some time to clean up and dry off and had lunch, eagerly anticipating for the next part of our adventure. So we just completed our rafting part of this tour. Next is lunch and then we are going to go zip lining. It's been an adventurous day. And we are now on our zip line part of the tour. We geared up for an exhilarating zip line ride that soared high above the stunning canyons, offering breathtaking views and an adrenaline rush like no other. The zip line was the perfect grand finale, capping off our epic day of rafting, off roading, and muddy fun. Get it. After a refreshing shower and a bit of time to freshen up, we headed to Varuna Geskin in Old Town, Antalya for dinner. This delightful spot isn't just a restaurant, it's a slice of the owner's adventurous spirit. Founded by a group of traveling friends who wanted to share their culinary discoveries, Varuna Geskin is a tribute to the diverse dishes they enjoyed during their adventures. The walls of the restaurants are filled with souvenirs from their trips and shelves filled with books all collected during their travels. Each item tells a story adding to the restaurant's warm, eclectic vibe. What's even more exciting is that once a year, the owners take their staff on an international trip allowing them to explore new cultures and cuisines all together. Do me a quick favor, if you like this video, hit that like and subscribe button. The restaurant had a good story, but unfortunately, we could not say the same thing about the food. And of course, it's nothing that a pitcher of sangria can't fix. But even that wasn't that good. Thank you, Turkey. We are going home.